chest. Close your eyes. Sit up straight. Kind of meditate. I want you to focus on all of your blessings. All of your blessings. Don't worry about your burdens. Keep your eyes closed, please. Focus on your blessings. Just your blessings. Many times we get so bogged down in the day to day struggles and stresses and strains, the troubles and trials and tribulations, that we forget about how blessed we truly are. If you have food, if you have clothing, if you have shelter, you're blessed. Even if you didn't have food, clothing, and shelter, I would say that you were blessed. Because until you can realize that you don't have what you want, then me to believe that you at least think on that mind be able to think is a blessing. To, have, to be able to have your right mind is a blessing. So, with that in mind, I want you to throw away all of your troubles, all of your trials and all your tribulations right now, all your burdens, all your brokenness, all your barriers, all the things that are bothering you right now. And just meditate. Deep breath, keep your eyes closed. Deep breath. 
All right, you can open your eyes. As always, start marching in place. Start marching in place. We've had to clear our back in a while. Get your back. <laughs> Up his arms, Claire. Up his arms. Oh, man. <laughs> you want to show off a little bit like this out there? Get up. She hurt you sitting down. <laughs> so I have to do it in the chair. You know, that, that, that sweet looking sweatsuit this morning. So, hey, I'll be too cute for the exercise. <laughs>
One, two, everybody out. Three and four. One, two, three, five. One, two, three, six. One, two, three, seven. One, two, three, eight. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Six, five, four, three, 
so far. Seemingly, you know, right now. <laughs> Sometimes yeah. you think, okay, where was that past? Yeah. You know? yeah. And so, but you know, we all have a taste of dementia. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. Kind you of. get so much. Right. So, yeah. but you know, you're supposed to exercise the brain. So yeah. I'm trying to exercise the one that I can. Mm -hmm. Well, whatever you do. Right. And especially if, if it's reading, yeah. a working puzzle, or yeah. stuff, something of that nature. But you know, you know, you mentioned that about exercise in the brain. Just counting down from 15 is yeah. exercise in the brain. Yeah. Seriously. Mm -hmm. Seriously. Because sometimes you'll be 15, 14, 12. Yeah, 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 you'll be yeah. 13. Yeah, I mean, yeah. right, you know, it's yeah. a chance. It's a listening. Right, listen right. But you actually you're exercising the brain, mm -hmm. believe it or not. Just counting down from 15. Or even sometimes what I'll do, I'll count up to 15. Say if I want to do a 30 second stretch, I'll count up to 15 and I'll count back from 15. That's a 30, 30 second stretch. But I'm saying that's exercise in the brain. Yeah. But what I would say, something interesting you said just now was about um, having the right mind. I can recall my big mom, my grandma, my mother's mom, saying, um, see, you say something along that line about. I'm just happy to have my right mind. But growing up, you didn't really think about it. Right. The older we get, <laughs> yeah, the older we get, you think about it, yeah. and you see so many people that yeah. it's not oh, there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right now, because I have a sister that has Alzheimer's, <laughs> and uh, she thinks I talked talk to her one day last week, mm -hmm. and talking to her, you have to finish her because she can't change the sentence. Right, right. Mm -hmm. She can't write her name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She can't. How long have you been battling that Alzheimer's? Oh, that's been about maybe three years. Right. Maybe longer than that, but we didn't know that. Right, right, right. right. So, but like now, we know what's going on with the doctors. You know right, right. What's, what's what. And uh, I talked to her and I said, uh, your husband said that you, were, you just finished eating your dinner. And she he said, I said, what did you have for dinner? Yeah. And she kept trying to, uh, I said, oh, you had beans. Oh, yes. And I said, I know you love beans. Right. She said, yeah, but I got, I got to get up. I said, well, where are you going? I got to go home. Mm -hmm. And see, her husband would do it like this. Where do you think you're going? And she will finally get out home. Mm -hmm. And he said, this is your house. What do you think I'm here for? I'm taking care of you. Yeah, yeah. So he said, you know, you stay here. Older, younger. She's my oldest sister. Okay, okay. And uh, she, uh, she just, uh, she just, you know, she. It's hard for me to see her like this. Her son, she only had one son. He's been dead since '94. Mm -hmm. And uh, does she ever talk about him? She doesn't remember. Oh, really? Okay. Because okay. mm -hmm. her husband, even, even say last year at Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. well, at my other sister's house over here, right. was more. And uh, she, he said, uh, you know, I've got to ask Mildred what is her son's birthday. I said, well, you don't have to go that far. I can tell you. He said, well, that's my security. Mm -hmm. And uh, and she can't remember. Mm -hmm. So it's his birthday. I thought, oh, I know that. So and then I know that because I got keys and all the. If I have to go over there, right. I have keys to get in. So mm -hmm. she had given me a set of keys. But she's just, it's just. You know, then said he said in the evenings she'll get on this kick of crying. She won't go home. Right. She won't see her daddy, and she won't see her mom. Oh, so she so she reflects back to her childhood. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You know, Alzheimer's. Um, they say now that people in their forties and fifties can actually experience early onset. Mm -hmm. You know, and then of course it progressively gets you know worse. And 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s, whatever, but yeah, I am. And you know, those like those like myself who suffer with migraine headaches. I've been suffering with migraine headaches for a long she time. With migraine headaches. So long. And see, we're more and successful. You know what I did? And I have to uh, practice all of say the 60s, 70s, 80s, most of them that, and my headaches were. Terrible. Yeah. I would be at work. That would, when they come on, you see little. Some I didn't see.
see, but I tell you, my head felt like yeah. it was bursting. And, and when you get into a dark room, oh yeah, yeah, and then you know you right a little bit right. right. But see, I would always get nauseated. Same here, same here. And when I would get nauseated, they tell me go home. Yeah. They knew I had to ride the bus, yeah. so somebody they would want somebody right. to bring me home. I'd come home, and I never really found. Uh, medicine to really take part, but whatever I took, right. I had to stay in bed. Yeah. But I had children, right. so I couldn't stay in bed all day long. Yeah. I had to get up, cook, I know, you know. <laughs> get things ready for them to go to school and stuff. Like that. And, 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 and sometimes with that, it would take me up to anywhere from 24 to 72 hours yes. to get back in the swing of things. That's how I it just day. takes so much. Oh, it boy. takes so much Ooh, time. Boy. Yeah. yeah. And so, no, you don't talk. I have an older son. My older son is slept with him. Mm -hmm. But he goes to the doctor for them. Yeah. But the medicine they eat, he might get eight pills. Right. And may cost them over $100. Yeah, yeah. You know, that kind of thing. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah, that's one of them that they Well, I've been blessed to just take the, the, yeah. the, the, um, the, the Walmart version of um, it's like the excitement for my brain. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it has caffeine in it and stuff. And so I've been able to take that and for the most part, when I see it coming along, when I see all those stars, I'm yeah. able to, to hit it off. But you know what I was gonna say though, you mentioned Alzheimer's. Um, those who who have Alzheimer's, uh, we're, we're, those who, who suffer migraines um, are, are susceptible to Alzheimer's as well as I suffer from what's called vertigo. When, you know, when the head is spinning, mm -hmm. and also it's like a precursor for stroke. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm not trying to scare anybody, but yeah. that's yeah. those are the facts. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, last year, just before I completed graduate school, I had um, the worst case of vertigo to the point, and my mama, I felt so sorry for it. I, 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 I allowed them to come. I mean, I, I sent for my mom and daddy from um, Michigan. They, they rode the um, Train down here, and she she was so pitiful because nothing she could do for me, and I just laid in the floor, on the floor, and I couldn't move. I, I just my head was just boy. That, that's that, that that's that's a crazy feeling. Yeah, I take her with me when I when I hit it. And I, I was I was um I was subscribed to that, you know, but I um fortunately I haven't had an episode, but sometimes when I when I get I, I, when I get in the bed now. I'm a little, you know, I take my time. Mm -hmm. And you know, I'm 45, you know, but I, I'm, I'm setting, you know what I'm saying all this, I'm setting myself up for the possibility of, stroke, for the possibility of Alzheimer's. Hey, yeah. All right, yeah. Yeah, and so, but again, that's that's a blessing too, mm -hmm. to be able to talk about it. Yes, Martin, yes. that sounds like, uh, you know, so I, I just hit it myself off on the seat you just did. Uh -huh. Oh, you yeah. did? Yeah, because of my head, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, you brought that seat? Yeah. Oh, I, she I, had one. What did you do? I, she had one of them. Uh, my head was hurting the head, and then I just hurt you that man. You saw me kept moving. I yeah. had to kept moving my head. Like, yeah. you, you feel better now? Yeah. For the most part? Yeah. Did you take your medicine this morning? I'm fine. Okay, okay, okay. I, I, I heard you talking about the headache. Right. And, and I was like, that's mm. my head. Just right back in here. Yeah. Yeah. Just pound right there. Right now it is? Oh, yeah. It, it, it didn't come down. So. Mm. Yeah, it, it, it just kind of like seizure. It's just kind of like that. Okay, okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. That's I started to go and just lay down. Yeah. yeah. Well, that, well the, the thing about with any exercise, the thing about it, safety is first. Yeah. Okay. You, you know, if you're feeling, you know, if you're not feeling well, uh, uh, safety, safety, safety. Mm -hmm. You know, do it, do whatever is necessary for your safety. And that's what's important. Is that? Yeah. Um, 
just yesterday, I was telling her that, um, call your father. Mm-hmm. You know, I, I, regardless of, and I said, I'm not being morbid or anything, but how would you feel if he died in that? Mm-hmm. And you didn't, and you, you know, and I, I just, I just tell her, I said, look, say I love you, express I love you more often. You know, we talked about that earlier before, you know, um, you know, expression, not just saying it, but actually showing it, you know, and because how many times did you hear you wish somebody had said they wish they would have said something? They wish they would have done something. You know, don't wait, don't wait when they lay right there. Give them flowers while they're alive. You know, and I said, God put me here to talk to you this morning about that. It's been going on for 10 years. It's time to, it's not the ball is in your corner. It's time for you to make that change. You know, it's good. Bless us. I'm glad to have you back, Father. Good to be here. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's a blessing to have the Lord in my life. It's amazing what God does for me. So, a lot of times, I don't even know He's working right. in my head. Right. And um, I heard a preacher say this morning, sometimes it's time to take a time out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just wait on God. Learn to just be still. Right. Be still. Be still and see the salvation of God. Be still and wait on him to work it out. I believe you told Moses that, but go ahead. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but um, in my I, 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 negativity, uh-huh. uh, what people say about me, they don't understand me. Right. And I'm not so, ooh, you know, mm-hmm. but I got funny ways. <laughs> and uh, people don't understand me. I don't live like some people live. I don't. And a lot of things that I should be right. doing in my life, I don't do them. Right. But it's not fear, but that negative. Right. And just because somebody say this negative stuff, that don't mean that it's so. Mm-hmm. And that can be a hindrance yeah. right. Right. to you. And it has been yeah. a hindrance. Mm-hmm. To me, right, right. my close loved one, my sister, right, right. because her jealousy didn't want me to be near my mom. She wanted my mom to herself, and she got it all to herself, right. mm-hmm. and the other children. But she didn't want me to have any part, any say so, right. anything. Okay. Mm-hmm. And I wish I had wished out there, mm-hmm. like you said, did it anyhow. Mm-hmm. Whether it was uh, 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 appreciated or what, right. anyhow, because that word on my mind just like that word on mine. Yeah, you yeah. know, the devil just visits. Right. He yeah. comes, you know, yeah. and, and destroy. Right. Destroy. Yeah. And um, I'm going through something now in church, but I'm going to keep on going. Right. Yeah. I'm not going to stop because yeah. something, I'm not this. I ain't that. Right. Right. I don't think the pastor should have her praying, doing this. I'm more. Mm-hmm. You know, I have a title. And I want my title. Uh, uh, right around. <laughs> she ain't got no time. She don't even know how to do this and do that. Right? Mm-hmm. But God still needs to me. And I thank God for what God is working this thing out. He's working out. And I know it and I see it and I hear it here and there, here and there. Right. You know, <coughs> and it's smart from you and you and you. You know what I'm saying? Right. And I'm learning to turn things all loose. Right. If I can't have it, they go. Mm-hmm. Even in my house, housework. Right. Sometimes I can't get my mind together to function. Uh-huh. And get to this uh, uh, seizure thing. Right. Sometimes when my blood pressure gets up high. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And, and I, I don't like lying and I don't like being lied to. Right. Don't play games, bothers me, really. But uh, when my blood pressure gets up, my head hurts and my eyes feel like they uh, just swell or something in my head. And I see rotated lights. Mm-hmm. Rotated lights. When I shake my head, my eyes cross. Right. And things begin to sweat. Mm-hmm. And, uh, so far, I think I'm with the right people, not in Baylor. I had to come away from the doctor. He, right. he worked on me for what he wanted to work on. The rest of it, the hell with it. That's what he did. Yeah. And, but nevertheless, that's, that's in the past. Right, right. And I'm asking him to work that out because he's, he's trying to go against me and call up other doctors and 
she can't pay it, and uh -huh. she ain't gonna pay it. And if she can buy an SEA shoe, yeah, I'll be glad I bought some SEA shoes to put on my feet because my body and my joints hurt uh -huh. and my feet hurt. But it was too much money because I shouldn't give it to him. Uh -huh. But so he's over charging Medicare, mm -hmm. and that's who's taking Medicare up is these doctors. Uh -huh. You see what I'm saying? He wanted he would accept the other um, test that was given to me that was proven through biopsy and blood work and stuff. Okay. He wouldn't even put them in the, in the, in, the, in my records. Okay. See, I didn't say it. I know I said it because it, he tripped his okay. When he began to give me some of the medication that they gave me for this problem, he messed his own self up. Just, just don't give a name because I'm recording this. Go ahead. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So, anyhow. Yeah, thank no, God. don't give a name. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> but these are things that go against you. Right. And we as seniors have to battle against. Right. Some of us uh, is afraid to stand up. Uh -huh. I'm going to have to fight for clarity. Yeah. I got to like, not fight it the right way, but I got to fight for me. Right. This is my life. Mm -hmm. so, so what's your blessing through all this? My blessing is that God blessed me to get hooked up with somebody else. Yeah, okay. That yeah. began to work. So I had a couple of stones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he knew it. Uh-huh. Methodist went home. Another hospital knew <laughs> it. But they didn't want to treat me because money wise. Okay. He went calling and get the result from them because he already knew before they knew. Okay. Okay. Because he gave the same test, the same test he gave to examine the same areas I watched. Right. And then when he messed up and told me that my liver was functioning only 65%, uh -huh. she said, uh, what's that? Uh, what would cause that? And I said, well, you may as well tell us, I'm going to find out. Ah, ha, 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 ha. I don't know what I'm saying. But God turned around. So we're one door closed, another one open. Yeah. That's right. Okay. He, he already he, yeah. he was working in my head all the yeah. time. Yeah. You hear what I'm saying to you? And these people gave me this, this another exam, which he had even given him an exam that he wants to say, tell them what to say on the report. Right. They'll be that way too. Right. So we can't prove that they, they, they knew that you had been in this situation. Uh, so I got looked up with another company. And I told this 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 time, I said, you tell me exactly what's wrong with me. I said, something might be wrong. I was bleeding, I was hurting so bad, I couldn't sleep, I couldn't sit up, and it's hurting all the time. Right. It was messing with my colon and they got my liver uh -huh. inflamed. Okay. You hear me? Yes, so anyway, God worked this thing out. Right. Told me I had stones. Mm -hmm. They couldn't find out why I was losing blood. Uh -huh. They giving me blood. Right. They find out why I'm losing blood, but when they find out, they didn't tell me. Mm -hmm. He refused to get the results because he knew. Right. Okay. And my mind went too swift and think like he knew what was wrong with me when they stopped and told me what was wrong because of the test and what they had examined. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You hear what I'm saying? Right. Right. But it's all right. I'm still trusting God to yeah. work it out. And, and you bless and talk about it. It's a right. blessing. Right. And he had the right mind. Right. They don't yeah. have enough sense to do it, but he just led me in direction. We asked God to lead us in the yes. right direction, yes. right path. Right. 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 Put a light before me so I can go in the right way. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Yes. But just be in the will of God. Mm -hmm. And I'm in trust God. Because he will bring out if you trust him. Yes. And when you ask him for things, yes. when you ask him for yes. things, believe me. Yes. Because you belong to him. Yeah. Your father and your mother of this earth knows how to give good gifts to you. How much more do you think he knows how to give you? So I have to hold on and I thank God for the blessing. I thank him for his word. And I, I realize even more so the word is in me, but it's got to be stirred. It's got to be renewed. We got to reread them and talk to the Lord. We got to have a fellowship. We got fellowship and not right, right, right. a fellowship with, with the Lord. Right. Uh, and when He opened up our understanding, our heart about His Word, about Jesus being in the Word, right. and sometimes we don't even know we got Jesus in. Yeah. <laughs> we don't know that we got the Word. We know the Word, but we don't know we got Jesus. Jesus is the Word, right? right. We got the Word in us. Right. Knowing who He is, yeah. but that Him.
kingdom movie. We got Jesus in our heart in us. And, and we got Jesus in us. We got the life in us. Jesus gives life. That's true. Jesus gives the life. Where the life is, there's no death. Where the light is, there's no darkness. Right. We can step away to get too far from him. And way over him, see the light curtain. Right. But around us is darkness. Why is darkness? The closer we get to the light, the more the darkness is vanish. Because we're in the light. You see what I'm saying? In the light. Hallelujah. And I just thank God for the word this morning. I thank God for being here. Share something the Lord has blessed me with. Be able to share it with you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right. Um, close your eyes. Please. It's Alberta, it's Adeline, it's, uh, it's Deborah. We'll get to you next week, though, as well. And uh, hands across your chest. Deep breath. It's good to talk about our blessings. Just to remind us of, just to remind us, to keep us focused on, on Him. So easy to talk about our burdens, but it's easier for me to talk about my blessings. Amen. You know. Deep breath, you know. I don't know about you, but you don't have to respond because I know you meditate right now, but I just want you to think about this. It, 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 this morning session just felt good. Mm -hmm. It felt good. I mean, mm -hmm. the endorphins were working while we were working it out and we released, you know, you know, you know just a long haul. It's just, I feel rejuvenated. And I worked last night. I didn't get, I didn't get off to the this morning. But, you know, mm -hmm. you know that. Yeah, I'm not gonna do any cartwheels, but um, mm -hmm. it feels good. It feels good. It feels good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I appreciate you coming out as always. You do a blessing to me, and um, and my goal, of course, is to be a blessing to you, just to just serve you the best I can. And um, you know, I'll do it as long as God gives me the strength. I'll be here. I'll be wherever I'm needed. Bless seniors. That's my purpose. Soon, later on, we will be talking about what's your purpose. Mm -hmm. What's your purpose? What's your purpose? Mm -hmm. When did you find out your purpose? We'll be discussing that. I have a, I, 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 I just look forward <coughs> to all the Jerry sessions that I have scheduled with you guys, and um, just talking about everything from A to Z, and blessing each other. One preacher will always say, we're blessed to be a blessing. Mm -hmm. So, one more deep breath. You open your eyes and all the way to give a Yes, oh yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Make that announcement for me, please. Mark will be here at 7.30 or 